for 57 British towns surveyed in, 19, in 2017 and 2018. Cambridge came top in the inequality stakes. The top 6% earners in Cambridge account for 19% of the total income. And the bottom 20% account for 2%. We don't, of course, really need that sort of research to tell us that, because you only have to walk, even in daylight, into Arbury, or to walk even further into the market towns like Wisbeach, for which the Holford Inquiry in 1950 held out such high hopes of diversifying the economy and the population um, of Cambridge. Uh, and you don't have to look at the new town blues that have been experienced by Barhill and by Camborne and doubtless by North Stowe uh, coming up. But we must remain optimistic. We should recognise that these are the challenges that Cambridge of 1900 was the great colleges and slums around, that our Silicon Fen is similarly a great university, a great town, and it is surrounded by pits of poverty. And we have to do something about that. I'm going to stop.